what I'm trying to do here is speak about the impossible mystery of life and it's just amazing <laughs> it's so beautiful that it's not an imprisoned mind devastating so challenging sad and frustrating how the hell can we go somewhere away from this silence happening now this aggression but we can't get anywhere we can't escape this and practical life crying feeling cold feeling warm but the mind the mind wants to to escape this present just present pooping fix it how the hell can we get out of here to keep it or to control this and to have this is it an illusion disappointing only this to describe this is, is just amazing that's why speaking about this is in a way total nonsense it's impossible don't get anything because if we just go silent and if we just completely lose ourselves in the moment then there's just this resonance with everything about who you are, about what your life is, about what you're doing, right or wrong. Completely expose yourself, really be vulnerable with yourself and completely be honest with yourself. But you lose the idea that your mind has, your thoughts have about you, good, bad, beautiful or disgusting. And you are it. It's all irrelevant when there's only this expression of the moment. You are this expression of the moment. The way you are now and the way you are feeling and the way whatever you're doing, whatever is looking through out of your eyes, that's it. There's only this roller coaster of life happening in this incredible moment the rush through the body the heat analyze energetic patterns conditioning but in the end it's just making this maybe more painful because then you have to dive deep going through this exploration and this anal analyzing of patterns of what you think you are but the mind usually doesn't like to explore what it's not it's not interesting it's not interesting for the mind to explore what it's not it wants to become something wants to be something it has to has to take shape it has to happen it's going to happen in the future yes it's it's coming it's going to i'm going to reach there i'm going to achieve something that's what the mind is looking for. That's what this whole movement of division in life, the way the human is set up, is, is, is about. To get somewhere, it only wants to explore what it is or what it wants to be. And I feel so passionate about tearing this illusion apart, losing this idea of, reaching somewhere, and becoming someone, becoming something. You are it completely, fully, totally, forever and ever. You are in life, after life. There's just only this movement, mystery, happening. Great. I think this is really the most difficult way of speaking about something that can't be spoken about. Inventing this art of communication communication beyond words so maybe not take my words so literally intellectually or trying to analyze this it doesn't work i've gone through a lot of shit so in my experience it's all about diving deep in your experience whatever it is 
to completely and fully embrace this or go through this resistance, go through this intense feeling of vulnerability and not knowing or feeling very fragile or uh, insecure or whatever. So it's not about intellectually knowing the mystery of life. There is absolutely no way to intellectually know the mystery of life. There's only mystery, only mystery. And we are the mystery's puppets. We're the puppets um, playing our games, playing our roles, playing our daily life, having all the sensations and we have to deal with it, feeling identified, challenges. It's just incredible. If you don't feel, don't do it. Reflect on your sensations. What do you feel right now? What do you experience at this very moment? Take a deep breath without you needing to change anything. And it's all one big movement. This is energetic resonance, an energy that clings on to us, that we identify with. Or oh, maybe your body is programmed, it's conditioned. It's actually a resonance. Oh yeah, be aware. Who knows? Maybe it's not. This is a new moment. This is a new experience. Let yourself be surprised. Try to just stay open in whatever kind of situation you're in. Of course, the mind comes because it's conditioned to relate to fixed ideas, certain values. That's not a problem. There is no problem. There is only the openness of the moment. And also the body, it's also completely open. Try to just stay there. It's complete vulnerability. That is what you are. That's what this mystery is. Completely vulnerable, unconditional, here. And you're completely safe in this. The only thing that actually can happen is that you can lose the illusion of you not being safe. You are always safe. You are always whole, undamaged. Nothing really can save you. It's just the idea that you are whatever you think you are. And that idea can be lost. <laughs> so, people are doing it themselves. Being so far from this suffering happening. This contraction is happening and natural, childlike uh, openness, like animals. Really, that's the only movement of life happening in, in, inside of yourself. And then there's this immediately, this contraction, there's this idea of, oh, this went really wrong, or what I said was bad. I'm not a good person. And there's all these thoughts. It's not real. A fixation, an old idea. That's really what it is. It's not good to cry, oh, this is bad. But in essence, there is no good and bad. There's just what's happening. And we, we just think, we think that we know it all. We have all this figured out and it should be like this and it should be like that and that, that that's what's happening it's the idea about these things and maybe that's why it's bad explore this because it's not a fixed thing make it clear i need to focus reflect on it without any judgment as it is the mind the when you do i have to do this now you know don't disturb me there's just this 